In this Blender tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can quickly import a collada file from SketchUp and then merge all the vertices after already resetting the scale and location. I've previously shown how to merge vertices on individual objects, but you can also do it to the entire model at one time, which really speeds up getting your model ready to apply materials and render. The first thing to do is go File, Import, Select Collada. Navigate to where your Collada file is and select the file. Select Import Collada. With everything already selected, the Collada file has all the objects ready to go. So you can go right ahead and press Control A and then select Scale. This automatically resets the scale. And then we can press Control A one more time and select Location. This also resets the location, so now everything is where it's supposed to be. So you don't have to deselect and then select again. So now you notice all those red dots disappear and we have our Collada file much more ready to work with in Blender. I'm gonna go ahead and click the default cube, press X to delete. Then before we merge all the vertices together, what we wanna do is select the top wall section, press tab to go to edit mode, press three for face mode, select this face, and then we want to press G for grab, move, and then press Z to move straight up. Because if we merge this now, all of these will merge together and then we can't lift the ceiling off. So we wanna move the ceiling out of the way. Then we can tab back to object mode. We can select all of these objects here, then tab to edit mode, press A, it selects all the vertices. And so then we can press M to merge and we'll select merge by distance. And so now it's merged all those vertices together and we can tab back and we can still see that we have all these individual objects and we've removed about 13,000 vertices and we still have our roof that's in a different spot and we can edit everything as needed. Then I can come back over to SketchUp here and I can start parenting my different things together. So I can select these with the shift key. So these instances hold shift and drag it to that instance. I can shift click these instances and drag to that one. I can make the light switches parented together. Shift click both of these, shift drag. I can put the pillar into the walls, the wallboard into the walls, the outlet into the walls, this outlet as well. I'll probably wanna put the door stop. I'll put that in the walls as well. And the ductwork can stay where it is. I'm gonna relabel this instance as door one. And then I'll relabel this instance as door two. And then this SketchUp camera, we wanna delete by pressing X. And then finally, we don't need everything in SketchUp. It's perfectly fine to leave it in SketchUp like that, but we can just shift click all of these objects, hold shift, drag up to the top of the collection, and then everything is moved out. Depending on how you want to organize things, you can change that. And then I'm gonna go ahead and press X to delete that SketchUp group. And probably it's not a bad idea just to shift click the light switch into the walls. So now I have all these objects ready to go and I'm ready to start adding materials to my objects. So I can change materials or add materials. The only other step that I showed in the previous video was to select this object in object mode because if you notice, we can't shade it smooth, but it's already taken care of because we did the merge vertices on all of the objects. So this is a great way to quickly merge vertices and keep the different groups and objects from a SketchUp import while you're working in Blender.